Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Madison, and guess what? This is a big weekend for the Nutcracker rehearsal. Let me tell you why? Because Kansas City Ballet is coming back to our Kennedy Center. And so this is really exciting because now we're gonna learn like the full choreography, what we're gonna do like for the rest. Because we've been, we learned like some of the choreography. We, we learned like about half of it. Like we learned the march, we learned what to do in like the opening, but we didn't learn what we do after that. So it's gonna be really cool to find out what we do after that. And I already know how to break the nutcracker. I learned how to do that. It's fun. Cause I get to like sneak in and be like, <laughs> I'm gonna sneak in. I'm like hiding behind the clock. It's really cool. And, and yeah, I'm just really happy to do this. So yeah, the, today is like the first day I do not have rehearsal. That's a Friday since it started. Today they're gonna be rehearsing, I believe the divert dolls, the lambs, the reindeer. Yeah, all like the um, more smaller roles. Well, not, not even the smaller roles. I think the reindeer are like advanced. I'm not sure, maybe. But it's, it's kind of cool because Ella, when the girl, you guys know Ella from Miami, right? You should know who Ella is if you watch my videos. Or at least I mentioned her. She is going to be, I think her rehearsals are gonna be starting this weekend. So she's gonna like learn her choreography too. So that's gonna be fun to see what she thinks of her role because I don't think she knows anything about her role yet. And also this would be the week Colby started rehearsing too. If he was, actually no, I don't, I think Colby would have been rehearsing if before, I think, I'm not sure. Because I think Colby, he was a divert doll, but he had to turn the role down because he was in something else. I think he would, I think he's already starting rehearsals. I think he would have been already starting rehearsals because he's in, a, he's in the battle scene, I'm pretty sure. And battle scene has had rehearsals. Maybe not, I'm not sure, don't trust me. <laughs> but yeah, everybody's gonna start learning more choreography. I'm gonna see how I do with the new choreography because I haven't seen it at all. And I think I, might, I, think I kinda know what I have to do because so far the choreography hasn't been too different from the Nutcracker last year. It's just, it's kind of been similar. It shouldn't be like so, so, so different. So our rehearsals are gonna be in the reach. So our rehearsals are gonna be in the reach back facility and which is kind of, it's like in the back of the Kennedy Center. It's not in like the main building. It's kind of like on the side. Well, not the side, like it's just behind like the, every, all the main things. And you like kind of go down. It's a, it's a really nice place. Um, yeah, so we're gonna be rehearsing there. We were rehearsing there for like the first, the first week when we were at the Kennedy Center. And also, we met the um, artistic director, Devin Carney. And it was really nice to see him, learn about their company, kind of meet their staff. Their staff is really nice. Like, they are really nice and really kind people. And they, I think they're really good at choosing roles because the people in the party scene, they're really good. So yeah, clearly they know what they're doing. They're not, they definitely really know what they're doing. And I'm also gonna try and like grab some photos in the, um, of my rehearsal. I'm not gonna try and grab too many because obviously they don't like that. I'm gonna try and grab, I don't know, maybe just one or two, see if I can put it in the video. And also if you wanna learn more about the reach, check the, check the um, link in the description, okay? By the way, I'm gonna my, I'm gonna ask my mom to show a picture of the call sheet for us, so performers will know when to go to rehearsals. I'm gonna break for now, but next time I come back from rehearsals, I'll make more videos. Bye. Hi guys, rehearsal recap time. So, Saturday we started off, it was like 5 to 7.30, that was our time. I was really happy to be back at the Candy Center. The artistic staff from last time were there again, except for Devin Carney, he was not there. The artistic staff this time were Miss Kim and Miss Lauren, who were there last time, but the artistic director of Kansas City Ballet, Devin Carney, was not there. So yeah, it was nice to see them again. And we learned some new choreography, and we went over the march in my in 
my entrance. Apparently, I was going a little bit too early on my entrance. I go run in. I go, like, I was doing that a little bit too early. So, I have to, like, make sure I don't do it early. And also, I am still partnering with the ghost. So, <laughs> that's fun. But, hey, it is what it is. I'm used to it. Um, so, yeah. So, what we did after that was we went over gifts. And gifts is actually really fun. I really love my role, by the way. My role is so good. It's, like, actually so much fun. No wonder why Colby loved his role so much. Because it's a fun role. It is a fun role. You get to be sneaky and you get to be running around. And, yeah. So, basically, I'm also not a prop on stage. Like, I mean, I wasn't a prop on stage, but during the party scene, I was kind of a prop on stage. Except for the grandfather's dance. So basically what we do is that we're all excited. I go over, I go into like a little corner and they're all coming to me and I give, I just point at gifts and they take it. So yeah, that part's kind of boring, but whatever. And then after that, we go to like the toy store and we're all watching like Joss Meyer with his toys. It's really cool. So yeah, that's really fun. And then also <laughs> something really funny is that you know, if you know the Nutcracker, you know that the, there's um, dolls when they dance in the party scene. In this version, there are two dolls, a boy and a girl. Well, I'm not sure if it's a boy and a girl, but there's dolls. They dance. And yeah, that's the same. Well, in this version, there's a whole bear. There's a bear. Just, I don't know, I don't know why they thought of it, but whatever. Just, just put a bear in there. Why not? So that was interesting. And also, the bear picks me up. <laughs> and also, he tries to attack me. So the bear is crazy. <laughs> it's really crazy. And after that, basically what we do is that we go to dinner, which I'm actually not eating dinner. Basically, what I'm doing is I'm sneaking around on stage, getting ready to destroy the Nutcracker. And yeah, we also got to see the Nutcracker today. I learned how to like hold it correctly. And it's really cool to break the Nutcracker because you get to be like sneaky. You get to hide behind the clock and everything. It's really fun. I would definitely, like, this role is probably, like, the most fun role in the whole Nutcracker. I'm just going to be honest with you. I think it is. Because, like, this is the one role where you can basically, like, act however you want. You can always act mad. You can act sometimes, like, happy. You get to act like a brat. You get to do whatever you want in this role pretty much. Well, not whatever you want. But as long as it has ballet and you're doing the right steps, you basically can have you can pretty much kind of like just have whatever face you want. You don't have to be all like, oh, beautiful. You can be like, <clears throat> or just like, because <clears throat> that's what you have to do most of the time. I throw a lot of tantrums in this version. I'm always getting mad. Oh, and the, the funnest part is when, basically, I get, after breaking the Nutcracker, they put me in timeout, basically. I'm just kind of just like sitting here, like, I'm just in timeout. And then they play the music. Dun, 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 dun. And at, during when that's happening, I'm basically just going to the boys. And I'm like, all right, listen, I've had enough of this sitting out. And then we're going to go get our instruments. And then we're going to charge at the girls. It's really fun because we get to, like, charge and, you know, wave your flags, play your instruments. Like, it's really funny. <laughs> and also, the grandparents apparently are really funny in the grandfather's dance. I have not seen it. I don't even know what they do. But all I know is that in the recording, they are the, the audience are laughing. Like, they are dying of laughter. So, yeah. That's going to be interesting to see. And basically, yeah. I'm really enjoying this Nutcracker. And this seems like a lot of fun. I'm going to ask my mom to drop in a couple photos from this weekend. Bye!